All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here. You're looking at a little breakout board that I got off of a Parallel Miner website. Let me turn this around here. There it is there. And if we turn it around again, we got a little voltage uh, display here. A bunch of ground terminals and power terminals 12 volts and it works with the uh, HP uh, PSU server power supply and we just snap that thing right on well push it on and this will work out nice if you need to use custom length uh, cables for your GPUs or whatnot you know something like this but you know let's say this end wasn't here then you can just wire it up into there and uh, you have yourself a nice little breakout board for your terminals so let's plug this in <clears throat> all right so now you can see we have one light right here and if we get this centered up a little bit, here's the power button. We have power and we have 12.4 volts. And let's see what we're reading here. So we'll just pick a terminal and we're reading 12.35 volts and that is right across the board there so looks like the uh, the breakout boards working fine I like to actually measure each pin just to verify that the pins working there's no solder issues or whatnot because if we unhook this and we look underneath, as you can see, you can't really see in there unless you break this, push these uh, little terminal type things off. But uh, <clears throat> it has a little covered plastic clear thing on the display here. So we can let that on or peel it off, but uh, figured I'd just share this. This would work out pretty good for basically any installation, especially if you need to use a custom length uh, uh, GPU cables and you didn't want to crimp new terminals or whatever. So I'll throw a link in the description to my website for this in the video and a couple pictures. And uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another one.